Welcome to my YouTube channel. In this video, I'm going to show you how to, to install QV Tori along with uh, VTori. So the first thing that you have to do is first go to the link that I've provided in the description below. This is going to take you to the setup for VTori. So just click save. As you can see, I already have the two files downloaded, one for QVTori and the other for VTori. So I'll just extract VTori first. Open the folder, then click on the setup. Click next, I agree. Then next. This, this should take a few minutes. Okay, so I'll just click finish now. Alright, so once you have the software installed, just open it from your desktop. And after you open it, you'll see something like this. Now, for the next part, you have to download the, the V2Ray Core folder, which I've provided in the description below. I already have it downloaded, so I'll just extract it. Then once you open the folder, simply select all the files in that folder, right click, then copy all the files, head to your local disk, and then users, select your user profile, and then head into app data, local, then find the folder named QV2 array. Okay, so once you're there, go to the folder called Vico. If it's not there, simply create it. That's Vico in small caps, and then paste all the files that you copied. As you can see, I already have the files here, so just proceed to the next step. For the next part, you have to create a Vitori account. In order to do that, you have to go to fastssh.com. Once you're there, click on Vitori Servers here on top. Scroll down to select the server. Now, select this one here. Click on create Vitoria account. Okay, just scroll down. Then type in your details starting with um, starting with uh, the username. So I'll just put in Then under SNI slash bug, bug host, you can provide a, a zero rated website, which is a website that you can visit without any data. I don't have one, so I'll simply proceed to create the account. So down here, click on create account. Once that is done, simply copy the link that will appear up here. Right click, and then copy. Then head back to the QV2A software, which we installed at first. And then right here, click on uh, New. On the, 
secondo del dirt panel and then here on the text box under share link this is where you paste the link just right click and paste and then click on import okay so now in order to test the, the server let me disconnect from this one first and then select this one connect as you can see uh, it has been connected so we just test out the speed now the speed may vary depending on the network and uh, your location I'm using 3G so it may not be as fast compared uh, to you. Okay, so I'm getting about 1 megabytes per second, which is uh, not that fast, but it's still usable. This may be faster for you. And yeah, this is how you set up a uh, V2Ray and QV2Ray on Windows. Don't forget to like and uh, subscribe for more. See you in the next one.